Hi, everyone. Brent Wessler here with Kodak Alaris in another weekly post uh, today, everything Azure AI in the new Azure AI document intelligence framework. We're in the studio, uh, as you can see here, with all the pre-built models and something new is the custom classification model. And this is released in the 3.1 version. You can see here I've played around with it. Info input will be adding this as a classification option in the 6.4 release. Uh, I've come in and added a number of different sample documents. As you can see here, uh, I, all I need to do is drag and drop. Um, in this case, I have a multi-page invoice. I drag and drop. You can see it's two pages. Uh, so I'm going to just come in and click on it and tell it what it is. Uh, you can define your types over on the right. Uh, and as you can see, you need at least five documents per type. So I have some hotel bills, H HR documents, a bunch of invoices, car rental, uh, et cetera. And I come in here and I hit train and put in a model ID, AP invoice two, uh, and confirm and train. This will build me a model and then we can test it out. So utilizing uh, the classification model, uh, Azure does a really good job, not only classifying, but also splitting uh, the document. And I find it does a much better job than others. So I've already uh, created this model here. So we're going to go in and test that model. As you can see, the model's already built. So we'll drag and drop uh, that item in, run the analysis, and it will tell us uh, essentially what it is and how many pages it is. And if we do it right, it will automatically separate. And as you can see here, we know that it's one invoice that's two pages and it's 99.9% .9 sure. Um, here's an example. We'll take a other binder document that has two different invoices in it. And let's run the analysis on that. And in this particular case, it's two separate invoices, but I've trained them as two separate. So you could see uh, invoice one and invoice two totally different. And you could see that it recognized that these were two separate invoices and would split these particular documents. So this is a great tool for auto learning of classification. Uh, it doesn't, it's not limited in any way to the types, document types, as Google has uh, positioned uh, procurement and lending. However, you do need to add sample documents, which is, as you see here, very easy to do. You simply click on it and select your particular type of document, and the system will automatically recognize and process these documents in the appropriate method. Thanks, everybody, for joining. Check for more posts on LinkedIn here. Uh, please follow and subscribe.